Imagine a world where ambition drives scientific exploration to its limits, leading to discoveries that could change humanity forever. But what happens when that ambition leads to disaster? This is the story of one of the most harrowing scientific experiments in history. The Soviet bioweapons program and the catastrophic anthrax leak of 1979. During the height of the Cold War, the Soviet Union was fiercely competing for military dominance with Western powers, and that competition extended to the development of biological weapons. Among these efforts was a top-secret facility located in Sverdlovsk, now known as Yekaterinburg, where Soviet scientists sought to harness anthrax, a deadly bacterium, for use as a bioweapon. Their aim was to develop a potent strain of anthrax, that could be deployed against enemies with devastating efficiency. On April 2, 1979, a seemingly routine procedure at the facility went horribly awry. A fault in the exhaust system during the production of the anthrax spores led to the accidental release of the deadly bacteria into the air. Initially, the event appeared to go unnoticed, and the facility continued its operations, unaware of the impending disaster about to unfold. As days passed, reports began to surface of mysterious illnesses affecting residents in the surrounding area. Initially, local authorities attempted to downplay the situation, attributing the deaths of at least 68 people to an outbreak of food poisoning. However, as more and more residents exhibited symptoms such as high fever, severe respiratory distress, and unexplained deaths, it became clear that something much more sinister was at play. The symptoms were consistent with inhalation anthrax, a form of the disease that is often fatal if not treated promptly. With each passing day, the number of cases continued to rise, leading to panic and confusion among the local population. Hospitals became overwhelmed with patients, and the medical community struggled to identify the source of the outbreak. The Soviet government scrambled to contain the situation, imposing strict censorship and controlling the flow of information. In an effort to maintain secrecy, officials ordered the residents of Sverdlovsk to remain silent about the outbreak and took drastic measures to sanitize the area. It wasn't until years later that the full extent of the disaster was revealed. The truth emerged about the facility's involvement in the outbreak and the government's efforts to cover up its responsibility. Investigations by Western journalists and scientists uncovered that the government had deliberately misled the public, failing to disclose critical information about the source of the anthrax contamination. The revelation of a biological weapons program that had gone catastrophically wrong led to widespread outrage and fear, both domestically and internationally. The Sverdlovsk anthrax leak serves as a chilling reminder of the potential consequences of unchecked scientific ambition. The incident not only resulted in tragic loss of life, but also raised profound ethical questions about the responsibilities of scientists and governments in the realm of bioweapons research. It underscored the need for transparency, accountability, and stringent safety regulations to prevent similar disasters from occurring in the future. In the aftermath of the disaster, the Soviet Union faced pressure from the international community to abandon its bioweapons program and adopt more stringent safety protocols. The incident became a pivotal moment in the history of biological warfare, influencing discussions on arms control and the ethical implications of scientific research. As we reflect on this dark chapter in scientific history, it's vital to remember that every experiment carries inherent risks. The balance between progress and safety is delicate, and it is a lesson that should not be forgotten. The pursuit of knowledge and innovation is essential, but it must always be accompanied by a commitment to responsibility and safety. In a world where science can lead us to incredible advancements, we must remain vigilant, ensuring that ambition does not overshadow ethical considerations. What do you think? Was the risk worth the reward? Share your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe for more intriguing stories from the world of science and watch our next video. See you there.